I'm Cody Hyman. I'm a senior electrical engineer here at Honeybee Robotics in Pasadena, California, as part of our Exploration Technology Group. Honeybee Robotics is a spacecraft mechanisms corporation. Uh, we've been around since 1983. We currently have three offices, uh, one in Brooklyn, New York, another in Longmont, Colorado, and this office right here in Pasadena, California. Uh, my office specializes primarily in exploration technologies, hence we are the Exploration Technology Group. Uh, we develop systems like this drilling system behind me here. Uh, we've developed a number of technologies that have flown in space before on Mars rovers, Mars landers, and are continuing to uh, push the boundaries of space exploration in terms of sample uh, acquisition and handling for terrestrial bodies in the solar system. So at URC, I was both representing Honeybee and also providing feedback to the student teams as a member of industry. So my day-to-day -day job involves a lot of robotics development. Uh, so I was giving feedback to the teams on their designs, their design processes, uh, and their management uh, from my personal experience as an engineer in the field. And, and it was very exciting to see the progression of rovers from when I was there in 2010 and 2011. It's definitely a lot less stressful being an industry representative at URC rather than uh, being in the trenches uh, fixing a rover last minute for the competition. Um, I definitely had an eye for the designs of the rovers being uh, a former participant, so um, you know I got to sort of have a flashback to, to my days in URC um, and that really helped uh, sort of jog my memory on what works, what doesn't uh, in the field, which really helped me to give feedback to these student teams. There's always a lot of uh, bits of small advice I can give teams, but there are four key high-level points that I like to point out. Uh, one of them be start your rover early and try to finish early. Give yourself plenty of slack time, um, especially towards the end of the year for testing. Um, keep yourselves and your team well organized. Make sure you have things well documented. It really helps you in the field. Always focus on the main objectives at hand. Um, don't go off doing crazy stuff uh, that's outside of the main goal of getting a rover with a manipulator to competition. So focus on the critical key stuff first and then add on any additional components as is necessary. And then lastly and most importantly, keep communication up with your team. Talk to everybody, know what other parts of the system do. It's great for learning, it's great for organization, and it will lead to a, a well-built rover uh, that everyone knows how to fix and operate and uh, that will ultimately lead to your team having better success at URC.